welcome back to our channel and welcome to a three-part video so i'm gonna be reviewing chick-fil-a's chicken pepper oh my god i don't whatever this is this sandwich right here with this cheese on it the name right here i'm gonna be reviewing that pepper pepper i forgot the name of it and i'm gonna be doing a collaboration and a q a with bayou kitchen guy and me and mrs jones Okay, you guys. So first, we're going to go ahead and do this review. Pepper, what is it called? I don't eat it. Whatever it's called. So let's see. So it has the cheese on it, as y'all can see. And then it has three jalapenos on the bottom. Now, let's just taste it. Let's Pimento. Is that it? It's not bad. I was a little worried. It's not bad at all. Mmm. I actually like it. If y'all haven't tried it, check it out. It's real good. I also have some fries. So this is the second part to the questions that Bayou Kitchen Guy um, have us doing in the Q&A. So if you guys are not family family members of Bayou Kitchen Guy and me and Mrs. Jones, please run on over, check them out. Both of them are great family channels. Very positive. They do reviews, challenges. They're real cool people to have in your corner. Now I'm no wrong seat in the conversation center. Check this sandwich out. Good. All right. First question. I cannot see. I'm hungry. <laughs> So the last one I did, I talked too much and I didn't eat. This time I'm going to answer the questions. And I'm going to eat. First question. Have you ever met someone famous? Yes, I have. The first time I met somebody famous, they used to have this thing called Teen Summit in Louisiana. And I met a couple of famous people there. And then I met R. Kelly. And that was my first concert, too. I met a lot of famous people. I met a lot of... um celebrities over the past couple of years so yeah would you like to be famous i would like to be me i'm not starstruck so no i don't want to be famous i wouldn't want all of the attention if you could change one thing that happened what would it be I wouldn't change nothing that happened to me because whether it's good or bad if it happened to me I learned from it I 
I learned from it and either I grew from it or I just moved on. Have you ever been in the snow? Yeah. I've been in the snow. Who would be your ideal partner? As long as the person respects me, treats me and my kids right, loyal and faithful to me, and just has a good spirit, a good, you know, a good soul, God fearing. Do you still have your childhood teddy bear? No. I do not have my childhood teddy bear, but my childhood teddy bear was a Tootie Bird because I still love Tootie Bird. How many pairs of shoes do you have? I have no idea. And I'm not about to count. <laughs> What's your favorite holiday? Fall. Um, fall. Thanksgiving. Probably Thanksgiving. Thanksgiving will have to be my favorite holiday. And then it has beach, mountain, or city. I would probably pick mountain because the city is too busy, it's too noisy. The beach, you got to worry about hurricanes and typhoons and all kind of like, no, my anxiety. I can't, mm -mm. I could visit a beach, but I can't live on a beach. And I like country life, so I can do mountains. Mm. I can get my animals. <laughs> do you like TV shows? Yes, I do like TV shows, but I don't get to watch them like I would want to. What is your opinion on reality TV? It is entertaining. And... I don't have that type of drama in my life, so I get my kicks out of it. I'd rather it be on TV than in my personal life. So if it's not something that I'm living and I'm just watching it on a reality TV show, yeah, I can do that. I don't want the drama in my life, though. Where am I? Do you like scary movies? Yes, I do. Do I have nightmares? Yes, I do. <laughs> have you ever fired a real gun? Yes, I have. <laughs> Last film you watch. Um, I am King. Call me King. Call, they call me King. Me and Nisha sat down and watched They Call Me King. That might not be the name of the movie, but I think it is. Do you like roller coasters? I used to like roller coasters when I was younger. Too many freak accidents happen with roller coasters now, so... The only roller coaster I would probably get on is the Ladybug. <laughs> um... Have you ever cried to a film? Yes. I cried Lion King, Titanic. I cry on a lot of films. What is your current passion? My current passion is being a great mother.
I am very passionate about my kids. I love them to death with train for the world. So my passion will be my kids. How do you spend your free time with my kids? <laughs> with my kids, that's how I spend my free time. Are um, eating, doing YouTube videos, <laughs> living. I spend my free time living. I try my best to be as drama free as possible. I distance myself from anything negative. I spend my free time living. If y'all have any other questions that y'all would like me to answer, you can put it in the comment section. And I don't mind doing another Q&A. I have a couple of more reviews that I want to do. By your kitchen guy told me that Wendy's had a new sandwich. And I want to go try it. I told him I was going to hate this. And I told that sandwich y'all. I love y'all so, so very much. I will see y'all in the next video. Don't forget to run on over to Bayou. I'm sorry, y'all. It cut off on me. Don't forget to run on over to Bayou Kitchen Guy, me and Mrs. Jones' channel. Check out the answers to their questions. I love you so, so very much, guys. Thank you so much, Bayou Kitchen Guy, for inviting me to do this collaboration review Q and A with y'all. I will see y'all in the next video. And as always, hold on, y'all. And as always, mwah, mwah, mwah. Blessings. Hey guys, welcome back to our channel. Okay, you guys, welcome to a three-part video. So, I'm going to be reviewing the Chick-fil-A Chick honey, I forgot what it's called.